Hi there guys. I've put a video out for a little while now. So I'm just uh, trying to get caught up. So today's project that I'm working on, or starting work on, hopefully get it finished this evening. Um, I started a little while ago to be honest. Um, but the parts have just been sitting there, haven't had a chance to get a look at it. So what I'm hoping to build is a tow jack using this 30 ton bottle jack that I got on a press but I've swapped the press out to air over hydraulic bottle jacks so I've now got this jack kicking around spare so my intentions are I've got this a few pieces of C section or C channel um, that I've skimmed the face on on both of these parts and then a little while ago I was practicing some surface scraping absolute nightmare on mild steel but was good practice and I managed to get this to a nice surface flatness but obviously since then I've worked on some other more interesting parts so I'll be showing them in some later videos um, and this really didn't need to be scraped in it just needs to be a, a machine surface because the jack's going to be pushing with all its might <laughs> i don't think it's going to care whether it was still a rough surface or not but it'll make it much nicer having both surfaces nice and flat uh, and then i'll put a grease nibble or on the back so i can pump a little bit of grease in and help things move along um so my intentions are i've skimmed this side and I've also skimmed the back side on this piece. So that will stand as so. And then I've got these angle sections here that I have milled the rear face nice and flat. So they will ride up the rear like a guide to keep everything running nice and straight and then this piece will mate against it there with a little toe that fits into the C channel at the bottom there and then I think I'm going to double up the thickness that's 10 mil plate but I'm probably going to put another layer of 10 mil plate along the bottom to make sure the toe itself doesn't bend when I'm trying to lift a ton and a half machine <laughs> and then I've also got this section here which will join the lifting leg that attaches to the toe across the top there I've also cut that so it fits nicely into the C channel there and I'll weld around all the seams I can get to So that's going to give us a pretty sturdy lifting leg for this toe jack build. So I'm going to set to and try and get some of this welded up this evening. I'll just put you on to time lapse for the welding I think. Um, and I'll catch you after I've done the welding.
Right then guys, so it's the next day now, after I did all the welding on this last night. Uh, left the part to cool down overnight, just so I could <laughs> pick it up and work with it. Um, so, as you can see here, if I pump the handle on the jack, the tow comes up as intended. So I'm really pleased with how this has worked out. Now, obviously, <laughs> It still needs tested under load and I expect there might be some twisting, some bending, <laughs> but with any luck it should only bend a slight amount and should be fine. We should end up being able to now pick up and manoeuvre the Triumph TR2000 tool room lathe. Um, as the last video I made on that machine, I moved it into place. I've done some bits and bobs of work to it since, but I haven't got round to actually leveling it. So I will be leveling that machine as I have recently got myself some M16 threaded bar. So I've been cutting that down to make the leveling studs um, and some plates on the floor to distribute the weight onto the concrete so it doesn't just crack the concrete because when this workshop was built the foundations were never <laughs> thick enough to meet the spec of what a machine like these machines should be sat down onto you know so a little spreader plate onto the concrete just helps reduce any chance of damage to the to the floor but i'm really pleased with this that should give us the movement i need and then obviously i haven't got a spring return on it yet so we've got to push it down but it shouldn't need a spring return with the weight of a machine pushing down on it i think that jack will come down no problem so it's not pretty it's a little bit bulky but should be solid <laughs> 